점수 잡는 hackers. 네, 안녕하세요. 영어로 한 번에 끝내는 토픽 중급 듣기 수업에 오신 여러분 반갑습니다. Hello everyone and welcome to Hackers, the intermediate listening course for the Topic 2 examination. My name is Nikki and I will be your instructor for this course. Our course is going to be fixed with three different contents. I'm going to go over this every lesson. The one thing I want to emphasize on is the type questions. I will give you different type questions. This is a little bit different from the number of questions that will be given to you for the exam. I'm going to give you categorized types of questions that will be presented to you in the test. So for listening, there's going to be about eight types. So I'm going to tell you exactly what these question types are and why they are presented to you, how it's going to be presented to you, and how you should comprehend it. Number two is going to learn step strategy. How are we going to learn and solve this problem is our step strategy. Um, most of the time it's going to be around three to four steps. I want you guys to go over it and memorize it for each types. So if there are eight types of questions, I'm going to give you eight different step strategies to solve this problem. Last thing we're going to do is to exercise by solving problems. Uh, for each class, I'm going to go over about one to two problems. Other than that, I want you guys to go over some practical problems by your own. If you need more, you can go online or we can go over it later. After we've gone over the entire class, we also have mock tests. So when we're taking the mock test at the end, you could go over those problems once again. Let's see, and then, since our course is going to go over those three things, what is your responsibility for taking this test? Number one is to familiarize yourself with the eight different type of questions. It's kind of obvious, I told you, types are important. More than the number of questions, you should remember the different types of questions that will be presented to you. So, when we go over these different types, I want you guys to familiarize, become fond of that type. Number two, memorize the strategies. Since I give you the strategies, I want you guys to memorize at least what type, what step we took in order to solve that problem, right? And then review it. By solving problems. Don't just memorize, use that strategy and solve it with practical problems. Last one, repeat listening. All right. Um, with your textbook, there's going to be a soundtrack, right? So I want you guys to repeatedly go through it, familiarize yourself with that, and memorize core vocabs. Especially for reading, I don't want you guys to just go over and read the words and remember. I want you guys to listen and become fond of that sound and remember what that sound or what that word means. All right? So those are three main things I want you guys to do for this class. All right, briefly, just let's just recap what this test or how this test is presented to us. First off, listening is going to be the first part of the test. Right. Second part will be writing, and last part will be reading. For the listening, they're going to give you a total of 60 minutes for an hour. Right. The question itself is going to be 50. Points are 100. The points itself are all exactly the same for all three parts. Right. Writing, they're going to give you four problems, and they're going to give you 100 points for it and 50 minutes. So this is the least. Right. Last one for reading, since reading, you guys can do it by yourself, it's going to be in a separate uh, part. So you guys are going to have a little break in between. And for reading, uh, they're going to give you 50 questions just like the listening. Right. 100 points just like everything else, just 70 minutes. So they're going to give you 10 more minutes than listening. Right. Keep that in mind. So the total points will be uh, 300, which would add up to about 180 minutes, right, total for you to solve these problems. 
All right, so the topic two is intermediate. Remember, topic two is for intermediates. There is beginning. All right, that's topic one. So intermediate starts with level three. Uh, the people who get level three are going to have points from 120 or above. All right, it goes four, five, and last. If you have six, it means if this is the top score you can get. You have at least 230. Remember. Our total point was 300, so you don't need exactly 300 in order to get level 6, right? So let's move on to listening. This is a listening class. Once again, I told you there's going to be 50 questions and 8 different type of questions. So I've already categorized everything for you. I'm going to tell you exactly from which problem to which problem is going to be what type of question so don't worry about that right so today we're going to go over type one all right so type one they're going to give you a picture all right very fun to understand the question so they're going to give you a listening and a picture and you're going to understand what that listening or dialogue is saying and you're going to choose what that conversation is about that's type one type two is to understand the graph they're going to give you a graph same thing they're going to make you listen to a soundtrack, and you're going to have to choose the graph that best matches it. Number three, choose the correct following dialogue. So they're going to give you a dialogue, and you're going to have to choose the correct content, exactly what it, it is or he or she is talking about. Next, choose the correct following action. All right? A little bit different. You're going to have to choose the next dialogue for type three or type four. Type four, you're going to have to choose the right action what he or she will do after that conversation. Next, find the same content. It's pretty self-explanatory. If they say something, oh, this is correct. You're just going to have to choose the right content. Uh, find the central thought is kind of like main idea, right? What is the author mainly talking about? What is his or her? Central thought is going to be type 6. Next, understand the content. These two are a little bit similar. There's another similar one in reading too, but difference in levels and different in how they give you the passage. So the topics and how they give it to you and the level is going to be a little bit different. So type 7, I put that in a different type, right? So they're going to ask you if you understand the content well. Last one, understand the program, what kind of program it is. They could give you anything related to a uh, lecture or like uh, if you go to a different place and you listen to a conversation, right? It's going to have different topics, but it's going to be informative. That's a big problem, right? So it's going to be very difficult. Right? So those are the eight types that they're going to give you for this listening test.